long time ago there was a kingdom with a wise king he had great respect for people with knowledge and scholarship he used to honor them and give them expensive gifts there was a man in a distant city who was very knowledgeable he was a great scholar and thinker he prided himself of having a lot of knowledge which could solve many complex problems one day he thought of visiting the king and present his knowledge he was very sure that the knowledge would be appreciated and he will receive gifts from the king however for reaching the capital he had to cross a large river so he hired a boatman who used to help people to cross the river on his boat for small pennies during the journey the scholar started talking and the scholar told boatman about his scholarly achievements and his ability to solve any problem the boatman remained silent and was busy pushing his boat as fast as he could as he felt it was going to rain heavily it so happened that there was a sudden storm and heavy rain the boat was about to capsize the scholar asked the boatman not to worry and tried to give the boatman advice by using his knowledge of wind speed river current etc but there was no solution in sight the boatman could wait no longer and said to the scholar sir the only solution to save ourselves is to jump into the river and swim away come let us jump now the boatman jumped into the river the scholar did not make any move he sat rooted in his seat the problem was he did not know how to swim the story ended there now this story was told to me when i was a child at that time i did not know what to make of this story i did not understand what this story means only when i grew up and and went into a corporate career at that time i could realize the significance of this story now what it taught me was that only knowledge theoretical knowledge is not sufficient one has to have a lot of practical application of that knowledge and also uh, trying to apply what you have learned trying to think on one's feet unless we do that management is not going to work it's not going to be a success we try to give our students the practical aspect now how do we do that is the question we have couple of programs to do so uh the first we call what it un- what we understand from that is applied management now applied management means we have special classes special sessions where whatever they learn in theory is put to practice not necessarily through case study method but actually telling them how to apply in the day to day life of their corporate life that's the first aspect the second thing what we do is uh, have what is called corporate interface program now corporate interface pro- program makes them go actually to the field and uh, they they see the practical problems which are happening and they try to solve those through mini projects that again gives them a practical feel of what is happening now the third which is probably one of the most important ones what we call our uh, corporate skills proficiency program now we understand that corporate skills are necessary more for actually operating in a corporate atmosphere rather than simply applying theory so for these skills skills like speaking well think like presenting well things like talking well you know those things are missing because i have been in the corporate life in tatas for a long time i realize that a lot of people don't have that and they they miss out on their success because of this we have tried to make these programs and try to implement them what attracted me towards the international academy of management and entrepreneurship bangalore was the fact that uh, this was one of the few institutions that were giving me exposure towards what the market and what the industry were actually doing i was not required to sit in the class and go through boring theory but i actually got the opportunity to go out uh, work with industry professionals as part of my one year uh, internship program 
and actually learn what it is and how the industry puts into practice the theories that I learn in class. Besides that, uh, the teaching here was also something that is very different in that these are more industry professionals and people with work experience, 10, 15 years, 20 years work experience who have come here and it's a great opportunity to learn from them because they don't teach you from the book exactly but it's actually experiences that you're learning from. My mission is to create socially conscious, value-based education through our unique pedagogical model called Trust. I'm confident that IAME, its future managers and entrepreneurs would contribute to making India a developed nation by 2020. My task is to execute the vision and mission of IAME so that our students become well-trained professional managers and entrepreneurs. Post-graduation in management is all about grooming the student into a successful professional leader manager. It's also about preparing them to survive in the competitive, globalized business world. For this grooming process, we have consciously chosen an excellent eco-friendly campus away from city so that students won't get diverted their attention from studies during the stay here. I came here for the first time I was very scared. I saw that this, this place is away from the city. I might not get exposure to many things. But now being here from last two years, one year I was in the hostel, properly in the campus. And from last one year, I'm coming here, studying for, on sa Saturday, Sundays. It has been a great experience. I can just tell that um, the faculty here, the people here, you meet them on a, on a personal note. They are always there whenever you need them. Like when I came here, I thought I want, I'm, I want to go for finance, but they actually showed me that HR is the best thing for me. I have seen students who have joined us, they were very raw and when they have left us, they were very polished. All the credit goes to the instruments, the methods, the techniques that we are using in IAME. We have faculty who have a very rich experience. They are from the industry. They share their real-time experience with students. They teach theory along with the practice which is being practiced out there in companies. And this had made students learn theory more accurately. Uh, in a nutshell, I can say only one thing, is that we want to make our students ready for corporate life and not just the holders of a piece of paper called a degree. <music>